So this is running, uh, this is actually an, uh, this uh, Asus um, Prime tablet running Hawken, which is this new game. Again, it's made by a team called Adhesive Games. And um, it's, it's one of these games that you just know gamers are going to get very excited about, but they didn't dream they were going to be able to just pull out their tablet and drop into a multiplayer world like this. And so this is also um, over So this is playing, this is, this, your clay is playing on a transformer. Yes. Yep. Transformer Prime projected up into what is an Ultra HD projector. And on the other side, Clay is back there. He's standing, Clay, Clay is that curly head guy on the other side. And uh, he's standing in front of a television playing against Clay. Yeah, so what we're expecting to happen here is imagine you discovered this game. It came out at 9 a.m. this morning. It's still 9 a.m. You've already started to play because it's within one minute you're playing. Right. And then you tweet to your friends, oh my god, it's amazing, join me. They can then click a button. They've not heard of the product. They don't know where to go get it. But they're instantly in it in their browser. And, and then they're immediately able to, to teleport in and join their friends in the, in yeah, the this universe. Yeah, fantastic. So imagine beaming all your friends into your game the, the minute it comes out. And yeah, that's, that's the kind of thing fantastic. that this enables. What is more fun than a mech first-person shooter? Absolutely. Right? <laughs> what is more fun this than game, a mech? Oh, this is going to be awesome. Isn't it gorgeous, the, 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 the quality? This is the kind of stuff that we are so excited because as you put more and more compute in the cloud, mm -hmm. it's going to, we're going to keep going back to the developers going, no, 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 crank it even higher. We can That's put, right. put the game on let's, maximum Let's walk settings. over here. I mean, one of the things that, that, that you just said that I don't know if the audience picked up is that, in fact, because it's in the cloud and because we're always building out the cloud, mm -hmm. You always have the state-of-the-art technology in the cloud, and it's possible then to never be static. I mean, you're, the, the, the technology is literally getting better every single day. Absolutely. Right? Instead of, instead of a game console um, or a, a hardware platform that on the day that you buy it starts to get lesser and less good, yeah. in this particular case, the cloud gets better and better every day. That's yes. one of the powers of cloud computing. No, exactly. So when a game launches, yeah. we can send it to the very, very latest hardware. And this is kind of fun to see because we announced um, a deal with LG at CES this year where we're going to power their cloud gaming platform. And um, it means that now the television companies can participate in the game industry. Before, they were just passive. I kind of always joke, how much money did Microsoft make when people played Xboxes on your TVs? And the answer is billions of dollars. So how much did you make? And the answer has always been zero. But now they're able to have their own cloud gaming platforms on their TVs. Wow. Now this particular, just so that you guys see, you guys know what this game console looks like, here, come back here, Mr. Camera. Yeah, that green cable. This is your game <laughs> console. Yeah, there's nothing else needed other than a is green cable. Is this awesome? And, and it's, it's green. Uh, of course, you got a little, a little NVIDIA. <laughs> all <little>. right, all right. <laughs> David, thank no, you very much. Thank you very you much. You guys are going to be incredibly successful. We're having a lot of fun. Congratulations. Thank you, you very thank much. Thank you.